Rebellion. Mm-hmm. Yes, Professor. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Pick them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the Magic Neep. Wonderful! Mm. A prepared student is bound to bloom. Mm -hmm. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. Yep. Well, I had that flower boom. Such late notice. Plant the seeds there now. That mandarin that was needed. to harvest them later. Even the, um, so that plant that old boy when we were still. a bit of magic. They will take I time so to since, grow. I'm in my um. I'm in the flower in the flower class Let's now. See how to balance my stuff. And she was like, good that I got a student that's fancy, you know up to par on their shit. You know what I'm saying? Because she wanted me to go look for it, but I already had it. In the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Ready in nine minutes. Okay. Well done. Once it can be harvested, your destiny will be ready to use in Wiganweld potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. What should I be doing right now? I'd like you to get some hands-on experience with the Chinese chomping cabbages. They're in the greenhouse, just across the footbridge. Mr. Pruitt will assist you with them. Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But your lead. Nice work in defense against the dark arts, by the way. Excuse me? Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Oh. Well, thank you. I nearly put Sebastian in his place myself. Here we are. Home of the Chinese chomp. Go on. Grab it. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it and delve in the rest. anything they can get their uh, mouths on. Wow. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Vicious little bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. Uh, not saying you can't go it alone, but, well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. Trust me, Leander. I was imagining it the entire time. You were? I mean, of course. You're, uh, not someone to be trifled with. I see that. Dogweed and Deathcap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants, too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we, uh, probably ought to head back to class. Take your time. 
I'll see you back in class. As to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves. Ooh. I shall end our lesson here. Terribly sorry, Mr. Clopton. Go on, put it in. I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, I don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green-fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. But those mandrakes are really relishing their new pots. Only cost me my damned hearing. <laughs> Not yet yet. <laughs> you know, but I'm kind of cool with it, fam, because, I mean, you're learning so much. Right, yes. The inspirational of the game. Yeah, I mean, it's, that's what I'm really intrigued in. Crosswind. Did you know that you can use the mandrake to defend yourself? Did you know you can get out the way? Very idea. Why are you talking? No, I'm just <laughs> the chick. Yeah, she talking and shit. Watch out, dude. I got places to go right now.
Close that door for me, Sam. A little bit. Right there. Fuck it, please. Hello, Lucan. I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Excellent idea. This time will be a bit more of a challenge. Ready? Yes, I miss. That'd be brilliant. Wonderful. I'll set things up. Remember to cast all the spell combinations before the dummy lands again. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. of wand work. I'd hate to face you in a duel. <coughs> Could you remind me how the Dedalian keys work again? When you spot or hear a flying key, you're to follow it back to its cabinet. <laughs> Inserting it in the lock is the tricky part. I hope you follow some. If you open no, a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find, if anything. Professor Weasley is easily my go-to. Hello, Lucan. Is the final round of Cross Wands ready? Big match today. It all comes down to this. The moment that we find out if your training and dedication is enough to win it all. Ready for a shot at glory? I certainly am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? <laughs> I'm gonna flirt with him this yes, time. Yes, Sebastian. Then let's so get Sebastian. started. Oh, no, 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 we no, can no, make no. this a real victory. Mm. That's the spirit. All folders, my little suckers this time, huh? All right. Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> I'm just pleased I'll to have finish off the little uh, fire mission with Lucas. We're pleased to have such a gracious champion. Now, to the victor goes the prize. And so it is my great honor Fighting to against present like four you with this people. simple yet elegant token of supreme dueling accomplishment. Thank you. It's been an honor. You earned it. You are a duelist to be reckoned with. Now that we've definitively crowned the tournament winner, I suppose I should get back to my schoolwork. Wonder how my herbology plants are doing. I haven't tended them in ages. <laughs> the best duelist won, I suppose. Lost to a new student? Hmm, I didn't see that coming.
would never allow that. It would make him look completely incompetent, which he is. Protego! Lumos. Mm. <laughs> Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. It's so dope to see you will this begin game this term by brewing a Wigan Well a lot of potion. Gems, man. Mr. Takar, can you tell us I why they're this about particular you potion this season. I mean, might uh, come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wiganwell potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wiganwell potion of... You never know when you might need it. Please begin. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, Hello. correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing, and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. My parents could... Professor Sharp said that Wiganwell potion can treat injuries. Hope I never need it. Hmm. Okay. Revelio. Should you chop the Dittany or crush it? The wrong answer could result in the unfortunate loss of your eyebrows. My Wigan World potion's utter rubbish. Wish I could just replace it with one from J. Pippins. Fine job brewing your first Wigan Rebellion. potion. But there are many potions. Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? Yes, it is. Why do you want to know? Yes, but why does that matter to you? Brilliant! And it matters because you can be a part of something truly creative. You remember me, don't you? Gareth Weasley. Ah, mm -hmm. yes. We met in the common room. 
Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Ajurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single Fwooper Feather, as you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission. Perhaps you could grab it for me. Hmm. I'm not sure that's a good idea, yo. You want me to grab a fucking feather for you? Why can't you go in there and get it yourself? What you do, B? What you want? Right. Old boy wants you to go on there and grab a fucking uh, a feather for him, but he didn't ask the, the, our teachers. So he. We did. I'll get you the Fwooper Feather, as long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Fwooper Feathers aren't that valuable. Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. Ocean stations organized and free of clutter. Here's the Fwopper feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you! This is going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your Ajurus potion, and I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. Two things that cannot be rushed. Have patience and be thorough. Rebellion. And 
and now we add the mallow sweet. And that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Oh, Dragon Star! What happened? <laughs> well done, Gareth. What? Professor Sharp must have learned a lot during his time. As Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor, again. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. His accomplice will answer to me as well. I brewed an Adurus potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. Hmm. Oh my, I guess I say I'm sorry about that. He don't know that I done gave him that fucking. Yeah. yeah I'm sorry, yeah. Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learned a lesson. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. So let me ask you a question. You know those doors where well, you got to figure that bullshit out, right? Are they all the same? When it comes to putting those symbols and whatnot, because it's, it's different ones all over. Hello? Yes, yeah, it's in my car, mom. They're in my car. Okay, you me say.
uh, the little things that you said that we was looking for to uh, uh, on the walls, remember? And then open them doors. Yeah. You figured that shit out? You know what I was saying? Okay. With that being said, I was saying um, it's a few of them around. Are all of them the same? Cause there's more than one. It's more than one of those doors, fam. It's like three of those, three or four of those motherfuckers I was seeing around. Okay, okay, cool. So all of them, all of them the same on how you unlock them is what I'm saying. Oh, okay, cool, cool. That's all. <laughs> Mm-hmm. All right. Okay. okay. What you get out of there? Something nice? Okay. I think I was about to uh, I was about to do some try to catch up on this other shit because um, it says successfully avoid enemy attacks by dodge rolling. I did it one time out of ten, so I'm trying to work on go fight people at though. That's Oh, okay, okay. I got you. You can't imagine how inconvenient that is. Now you go, you go. Yeah. 
from Valio. Oh, okay. Just have the library annex. On another adventure, one? are we? Okay. Huh. Revelio. Cell phone. Okay, so I didn't because I didn't hit the door at first and shit. I, didn't, I that was the last one. I was just looking at the shits on the side. Okay. So how many of these bitches are we supposed to? So we just got to get these two bitches on the walls right, right? That as number two, the serpent, uh -huh. nine is bad. They got that serpent, okay, that's up there too. And then um, the 
is that three? Three, two. Okay. So I like that's fourteen in the middle. <laughs> Lumos. See, it got dark in here. God damn. Okay. Okay, so it's not as well. Let's equals our serpents. Three. Right. That's five. Okay. So eight, nine. Ten. Fucking spider. Okay. Yeah. Got you, babe. Okay, so. Okay. All right, let me see this. Scared myself doing that shit. <laughs> Just want to see something here because I have zero. That's far away. Fucking dark in this motherfucker. Is it nighttime? It is. Lumos. But I can't switch this for I oh okay, yeah, okay, I'm cool. Okay. Yes, I do. I don't know, it's three. That's that ugly shit. I got you. I got you. Okay, then. Okay. That's five. Yeah. Got you. Got you, got you, got you. Question one, we three. Let me go four in the middle. Got you. Oh. Okay. Okay, I got, okay. I got you now. I got you. Okay, so that's, you know what, that's, you know what? Until you tell you, until you told me how the triangles were up and down, I didn't be, I did not pay that shit attention, fam. You know what I'm saying? And then you had to, okay, good looking, good looking. Mm-hmm. Yeah, are you right? Yes. I got you, wow. Revelio. 
Whoa, there we go. That's a lot of juice here. Do me too. Ain't Ain't I gotta tap that bitch. Hey, that's another one right here. Okay. One by clad. Yeah, I got it now, baby. Yeah, that shit, I got it now. Yeah, it's dope. Mm-hmm. It's on now. Revelio. Rebellion. 
Rebellion. Rebellion. easily in that Revelio. Jesus, two. Rebellion. That was... Rebellion. Now I'm at this one right below this damn staircase. Oh, okay. Never mind. I got it. Never mind. Yeah. Okay.
Seven, that's uh, but that shit ain't that shit ain't on this one. Oh, they're bullshitting on this one because they got one symbol. Because that's not right. This one is supposed to be down here, and then this one is supposed to be up there. Okay, you see right there it says uh, 11 and 2, and then you just gotta get 21. Okay. That's 1, 2, 11, 12, 13. Yeah, the board's 2. 13, 14. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, which is number 7. 20, oh, so I'm sorry. Okay, I got you. Hold on. Okay, it's 1. Oh, no, I got my shit up. That's why I got it up. So, so, uh... Okay, let me show you. Backwards, got it. Okay, that's what it's in. This one right there. Let's see. Gotcha. Fucked up. That's what I missed. <laughs> there you go.
All right, this right here. Revelio. These shits be glowing too. These damn, what are these blue bowls? With the dragons on them. Incendiary. Oh, yep, there you go. He's beating the shit out. Ooh. God. Damn. Why you do your nigga like that, man? <laughs> That's crazy. He did him like he stole something. Lumos. There you go. Where you go? I lost it. I lost it. I got it. I found it. I got it. Okay. See, that's my third one. Well, my fourth one I didn't caught. I didn't got. So I'm just gonna try to collect them. Once I get them all, then I'm gonna take them to that shit. Yeah. Revelio. Can't go through there. Oh, I done found another one. God damn, look. Let's go. Let's go. That's it. Spin around and all that old shit.
Where's how you just see ghosts floating around this motherfucker? Rebellion. Not here. Rebellion. Oh, oh, that's what's <laughs> right, right. What are you up to now? None of your business, bitch. Oh yes, sir, fam. Look, I'm, I'm gonna be on here. Oh, did you hear about the new spell we're learning in Chalk? Revelio. What's going on, Rello? Yeah, my, I'm playing with Harry Potter. Man, this shit is dope as fuck, James. Everything. <laughs> Rello, not, not when I say that, James, I mean, I, I, that's, that's the only way I can put it. Like... Well, like this shit is so in depth. The graphics, the 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 nigga, how you make your potions, learn your magic, and like change, like this shit is dope, bruh. Like, and it runs so smooth. Rebellio. Man, bruh, James. Like this shit's insane, fam. I mean, I've been playing so long, I ain't even got. I ain't even got my broomstick yet, James. And I've been playing for two days. 
Nigga, I've been playing since yesterday and I ain't got my broom sticky yet. My egg. Rebellion. Yeah, I'm working on it, believe me. You know what I'm saying? I am trying to work on it. But it's dope, man. This is sound. Uh huh. Yeah, I play that. That's shit. I'll be that. That shit right there. Like, to be honest with you, probably three, four times, James. No bullshit. Oh, I'm not bullshitting. Yeah, Call of Duty campaign. Yeah, that's how hard I thought that shit was. I beat that shit that many times, bro. Mm hmm. Rebellion. It depends on how fast you get to it. <laughs> okay. You know, I mean, cause my, when I go through it, I, fam, I play that shit on veteran or the hardest, the hardest one they got on there. So it'd take me a couple days, at least, at least about three, four days. Rebellion. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented blue powder.
Revelio. Rebellion. Revelio. <laughs> Not bad. Revelio. Incendio. There you go. I knew it. I should investigate. Lumos. Shit, James, man. <laughs> This shit here, fam, is... <sighs> no. <laughs> it is just all a uh, campaign for right now that I do know of. Um, and it's... It's... Oh. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I would, uh... I would love to. Damn controller just died on my ass. I was broadcasting on my YouTube too. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio. It is good to see you, my friend. 
Hello, Natty. How are you? I hope you've recovered from our rather eventful trip to Hogsmeade. I am well, but I have been worried about you, my friend. With Ranrock and Rookwood and Harlow after you? I'm all right at the moment. We did not speak about it at the time, but I am hoping now you might tell me why they so were you looking take the for hat test and everything, James. I said you take the hat test when you get to the school. You take the hat test and everything, fam. And then whatever, it depicts on whatever, you know what I'm saying, what class you end up with. And I end up taking the test right, and I end up becoming a Gryffindor. Something that I wanted to become, too, which was dope. <clears throat> We're going to speak about that. They want something that Professor Fig and I found at Gringotts. When were you at Gringotts? Just before we came to Hogwarts. In fact, it's why I was late to the sorting ceremony. A port key brought us there after the dragon attacked our carriage. What on earth? There's one more thing. It's a bit odd, if I'm honest. Professor Fig says I have a rare connection to a powerful form of ancient magic. Is that the magic you used fighting the trolls in Hogsmeade? I think so. I I'm still learning, but... I can see traces of it, and I've cast magic I can't otherwise explain. I know that's a lot to absorb. It is. And I will have more questions. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. I realized something that day in Hogsmeade. You displayed such courage fighting that troll. And Serona wasn't intimidated one bit by Rookwood and Harlow. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Good. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair. And the fact that they're working with Ranrock, well... All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow is planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen, find out precisely what Halo is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. Be on your guard. Revelio. I always... beg your pardon! How dare you! Me. What's going on here? But mummy. <laughs> Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Revelio. Oh, that's enough. I'm too tired for your stories today. You stay right here where I can see you. Now, why don't you do some more drawings for me? Hmm? Very well, Mummy. <coughs> Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello. I'm Jalal Semi, and this is my potion shop. I can answer any questions you have about the town. Any whispers going about the town? You may have noticed we have a bit of a rivalry with Upper Hogsfield. Not much to it, but we're still the better of the two Hogsfields. <laughs> better than most other places, too. Can you tell me a bit about yourself? Oh, let's see. Well, I am Lower Hogsfield's preeminent potioneer. And I was once a lowly Hogwarts student like you. In fact, I'll give you the Hogwarts discount. <laughs> it's the standard price. My prices are low enough already, you see. 
What do you have for sale? I sell only potions and their ingredients. If you can't fix it with a potion, then it's best left broken, I say. <laughs> my ingredients are all local to this area, and my potions are brewed to keep you healthy and safe. What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? I'll have no trouble selling this. Thank you. A wonderful choice. Hi, yes, they do. a wonderful choice. They do. That'd be the problem, huh? Sometime. Well, shit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Pardon me, is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look elsewhere for wares. I've nothing to sell I'm now. Place I never thought it'd come to out. this. Be on your guard. Ramrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ramrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, Bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. Has Ranrock's lot ever attacked you like this before? 
They've been taunting and threatening me for a while now. But they've always believed that violence is the only way to get what they want. Things have taken a much darker turn of late. Ramrock is getting more powerful, and his loyalists know it. They feel untouchable. Ramrock assumed that all goblins would agree to follow him. But he was wrong. Many of us would like a diplomatic end to the discord with wizard kind. You mentioned that your paintings were taken. Are you a painter? I am. It's my calling, though most would think it an unusual path for a goblin. Most of my family work in metal, or associated with Gringotts. I'd wager my finest brush that Ramrock's lot have no appreciation for any of my work, and it'll be tossed aside for kindling. Without my carts and my livelihood, who knows when I'll be able to paint again. I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your cards. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I did enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be, I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. It was nice meeting you. I wish it had been under better circumstances. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banquet. I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. What the fuck? Rebellion. Rebellion. Yes. <laughs> 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 
Good. You only have Ranrock to blame. Yo. This looks intriguing. Oh, this is fucking stupid. This game is fucking ridiculous. Revelio. Lumos. There's a victory that came none too soon. This place has seen better days. Looks as if there's more than one way to enter. Oh, 
Okay. Oi, pass that fire whiskey over here. You have to learn to share. If only I could get my hands on Fanny for that student. Quite an enchantment. The carts are returning to arm. Someone there? Yeah. Off of me. That's your best. <laughs> something. Rebellion. Let 
Seems a pleasant enough little place. Okay. If you're here for my wares, on. I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I don't, I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good and wizard kind. Thank you for proving them wrong. I managed to free your carts fairly easily. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> you know, you've inspired me. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. Till next time.